So a video of me and one of the guys I trained with got posted. The video had absolutely nothing to do with the primary malfunction or a fail to fire, but that's the part of the video that went uh, viral, several millions of views. And apparently the internet was ablaze with how I did a primary malfunction clearance. I didn't think it was anything earth shattering, but um, anyway, here's how it's done. So when you're pointing in at a target and you get the stimulus of click instead of bang, uh, most people will smack. A lot of people will turn and pinch and push and pull or grasp and push and pull. Um, but with the optic, um, all I do is I get my stimulus of click and I immediately index while coming into my workspace, smack the base of the magazine, make sure it's fully seated. And I use a bladed hand with my support hand at about 35 degree angle, generally speaking, but it's in my workspace. I grasp the top of the optic with that bladed hand using the, the meaty part of my pinky part of my hand. And I push pull and circle back to my hand. And I can get my hit. So again, set up for the stimulus of fail to fire. So I'm on target, I get a click. Immediately workspace while indexing, smack, rack, circle back. So, again, the video had absolutely nothing to do with that, but uh, we were shooting some, uh, just, it was some Winchester white box ammo and been experiencing some hard primers with it. And it just uh, had lots of fails to fire, but I've practiced this, I've drilled it. And it is again, stimulus response of click, workspace, tap rack, 